Hi, I'm going to take you on a basic tour of Edmodo, the new version. If you used Edmodo, the old version, I recommend you watch the differences between the old and new version instead of this video because then you'll be able to see the differences and you pretty much know your way around and most things are the same. But if you've never used Edmodo and you've just signed up and you're going to be using the new version, which is what I recommend because why learn the old when it's just going to go away pretty soon if it hasn't already gone away by the time you see this. So here we are when you log into Edmodo your default view looks like such as this. So I'm going to go through the menu first. Full House is Home and what Home does is basically takes you back to your home page which is this page that we're at right there. She has your profile, latest posts, two new features, which I didn't mean to click, two new features, discover and insights, which we will talk about in separate videos. Here's where you find all your groups and where you can create a group and you can join a group. And if you want to see something about a specific group, all you have to do is click on that group and it will show you, give you all the information having to do with just that group. Now by default, when you go to your Edmodo page, it defaults to what's called latest posts, which basically it will show all the latest posts from any group that you're in. So I got computer technology, to the art teachers, to computer technology, to blended learning action research. So if you're in a lot of groups, there's going to be a lot of information here under latest posts. One way to sift through that is by clicking on the group that you want to see whatever information is related to. So if I want to see the new information related to the group Khan Academy, I can click on Khan Academy and it'll show me the latest post Khan Academy. If I want to look at the latest information on posted to AD 12 teachers, which might be important because someone in the district might want to post something to all the teachers. I'm in AD 12 teachers and up here will always show you where you are, whether it's latest post or what group you're in. Other things about home, over here you can check out your notifications. Here's if you want to withdraw from a group and advanced options will be are talked about in the notification section. Over here is your profile, so if you want to see your profile, here's your profile. <clears throat> this is a place where you can connect with people, you can edit, talk about yourself, you see what badges you're in, who your connections are to. Are. Under account, if you're in your new version and you want to switch back to old version, who's here? Here is where you can find your account settings and under your account settings you can do a number of different features and that's covered in notifications and settings as well the video that talks about that so you can check that video out for more things under settings you also have help report a bug invite teachers log out the most thing you're going to use under account is passively your settings and it is a way of getting to help the next icon stands for planner which used to be calendar and it's basically a calendar that you can use and you can use to communicate with your students or parents and I don't know why it's not letting me